Well, let me tell you something, brother. Snort, snort, snort. Cody. Drip, snort, snort. I got the drip. So I got a ginormous $5 tip. It's like a ginormous paragraph, all right? Let me let me first play the animation, get it on the leaderboard, and then I'm gonna read it. It's a huge paragraph here, okay? So, from Boulder Startled Shoulder, whatever the hell that means, that's the guy's name, I guess. He says, a bit of a rant here, hear me out. I don't understand your haters. Now, by the way, he's going to reiterate a lot of the negative things my haters say about me. I'm not going to repeat that because that just gives them attention. But I'm going to basically summarize what he's saying. He says, I don't understand your haters. All the stuff they say about you, I'll go through what I know. I'm not going to read it because you guys already know the bullshit. And I'm not going to reiterate their misinformation and give them a venue here for it. Okay? So, he says, at the end of the day, if you admitted to all the bad stuff people say about you and said it was all true, I wouldn't care. If you told me it's all a lie, I still don't care. I watch you because I think you're funny on camera. Your gameplay's funny. What you do behind the scenes, I just don't care. Them trying so hard <clears throat> to harm you by accusing you of all of this stuff, even if it's true or not. Nobody gives a shit who actually likes you. If aliens literally invaded Earth tomorrow and it's all over, the news people would forget about in a month and go on with their lives, so I don't get why it matters so much to them what you do and don't do absolutely positively correct can i be honest with you that is exactly what mike clum said to me when we were working on the documentary he said i think the most fascinating part about your story is that you haven't done anything at all that would warrant the amount of hate you get on the internet it doesn't make any sense like the amount of haters you have the amount of people covering your content and restreaming you and making videos negatively about you every day none of it makes sense because you're not anything that would warrant that level of attention so one of the big fascinating parts about a documentary about me would be covering why so many people care about me right i literally am doing a stream that gets a few hundred viewers a day i do videos that get a few hundred viewers a day <clears throat> right do I make a living doing this? Yes, I do, and I'm very happy that I do, but I am small potatoes, right? I don't have a real giant mainstream audience for my shit at all. So why does anyone give two shits about what I say? Right now, if I insulted Keemstar on this stream, why would he go on his social media and make a video to clap back at me? Nobody cares that I insulted Keemstar. I'm nobody, but he, he still wastes his breath on it, right? It's so bizarre that big YouTubers from all over, people like Moist Critical and Asmin Gold would ever mention me. Why would you mention Dark Side Phil? I'm no one, but they do. It's fucking bizarre. <laughs> I don't get it. What warranted the attention? I don't know. Nothing happened. Nothing crazy has happened. I'm just, <laughs> I'm lost. I'm just as lost as you. I don't understand it. <clears throat> See, that, that I agree with. Yako Almighty says, they don't hate you because of what you've done. They hate you because it's fun for them. They have a community built around it. I got the drip going. 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 It's like a faucet that's dripping. You can't make it stop. So what do you want me to do? Have a, have a mute button that every second I'm tapping the mute button just in case I, I'm going to have to clear? Like... This is what I mean, these, these dumb kids. This is what it is, it's dumb kids. 